Alrighty, hello everyone. Uh, welcome to the half pick your team, half random break. Um, it is noon on twelve four on um, what day is it? March twenty fifth. So the break filled last night. I am uh, opening it today. Because it filled pretty late last night, so I'm opening it today, doing the break today. So, um, let me tag you guys that are in this break. I found the video. So, I will random your teams live. You'll see how I do that. Um, and yeah, this is, this might not be my last, uh, random and pick your team break. Cause I still do have, so I'm all after this, I'm going to be all out of this Bowman Chrome mega box. And then I'm going to be all out of tops Chrome. So I'm going to be all out of that, but I am going to have Bowman platinum. So I still have four of these left. Um, if anyone wants to buy these off me at cost, I paid 23 so plus shipping. It wouldn't be that much extra for shipping. Um, I've got four of these left. Otherwise, I might do another random pick your team break. But with it just had top series one um, in it. I'm not sure really if it would fill in how fast it would fill if it does. Because I know that top series one is pretty readily available. Um, but it's all I have for right now. Um, so, uh, I might, I might do another one. I might, uh, but as far as like, this format goes, this is, I think the fifth one I've filled of this. A lot of people like it. I, I would like it too, if I was into baseball. It's appealing because baseball, I think with this stuff, there's not really many teams that sell for, a lot more than other teams so just pick your favorite team and then the other team will be randomed to you so you guys have done that already um i've i've got the i've got your um names here so i'll show you that but it's it's pretty exciting sort of stressful not really stressful but pretty exciting good to make history typically i do two breaks in a weekend but now i'm gonna do three so I've got another one tonight at five. That's going to be football. That one's completely filled and paid for. And then I've got another football one tomorrow. So three whole breaks. Typically I do two, but this, you guys filled this within, um, within the weekend. Typically the other ones, I've done the other ones on a weekday. So I'm just uh, tagging people that are in this break. You guys that are in this break. <clears throat> um, tag you guys and then I am going to random it so you guys aren't uh, waiting. And then you can figure out what random you get. Let's see, Mike. We got Mike in here. Ron is Ron in here. I hope everyone joined this group. That way you can watch it. Otherwise, you might be watching this on YouTube. I'm going to put it up on YouTube afterwards. So... Otherwise, you could also watch it after the fact on my group here. Yeah, tag Chris. Oh, Chris is already here, but I think I'll just tag him anyways. And Brian. Brian looks like he's not in the group, I think. 
All right. That should be mostly everyone who's... Uh, that should be mostly everyone who's in this break, besides, I think, two people. So anyways, yeah. Um, typically, also, I like to let you guys choose your boxes, but like what I said, uh, Jack, yes, this is it. This is the... Um, <laughs> this is the break. This is the break that we've all been waiting for. Um, yeah, typically, I like to let you guys choose your boxes, but I... Uh, this is the last... Mega box I have of this. These are the last blasters I have of this. So hopefully they, uh, the other breaks, they saved you the best for last. I'm hoping that it's good. But like what I said before, I have four of these left still. I've got some top series one. So I might do another half random, half pick your team. I'll try it out. Um, but it's going to be this and top series one. So it sort of sucks that I'm all out of... Um, all out of everything else. But yes, pull some fire. I am going to... My Facebook has been going off today because as you see, I got this break. I was saying it before. I've got this break doing right now. Going to do this break later at 5. Then going to do that break tomorrow. So I've got three breaks this weekend. Why did I put a 5? I got three breaks this weekend. So... <laughs> uh, yeah... Anyways, uh, I will check this notification quick, and then I will, um, show you guys a random. I'm going to random the teams. All right. So I'm going to put my phone here. So hopefully you can see what I'm doing. <laughs> Got so much in this spreadsheet. Typically it's not this packed. But um, here we go. So I random them on random.org. Many breaks breakers do the same thing. So I'll pull up random.org. Gonna have two. Gonna have two of these. One of these is for your names. One of these is for the teams. And then one of them is good. So three, actually. One of them is going to be the dice. Um, all right, dice roller, two dice. So here are, this is, here's football. Here's football again. So pay attention to this, all right? This, this is the baseball. So, here, I'll see if I could adjust it. There we go. All right. So I've got your names here. So Jack has Atlanta. Richard has Baltimore. Michael has Chicago. Um, Jason has Kansas City. Jack has Angels. Oh, Jack, by the way, I think you're watching this. <laughs> I did, when you first broke with me, um, your name wasn't that special to me, but now your name is pretty special, by the way, because I actually have a student name with the same name as you. Fun fact. So <laughs> every time I write your name, I think of him. He's 6'6". Six, six. He plays basketball. Um, Richard, got you. Uh, Michael, yeah, Yankees. Richard has Richard has the uh, Dodgers. Uh, Mike has the Phillies. Ron, you've got the Pirates. Padres is going to Brian. Giants, Richard. Mariners, Joe. Cardinals, Chris. Rays, Joe, and Blue Jays, Brian. So these are, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You <laughs> you can look them up. Well, I don't know. If you don't have to look him up, but um, he he's six six. He's just huge. He plays basketball. He's going to college. He's a senior, so I thought it was hilarious. I I mean, you broke with me a long time ago, I think, but now I I know someone with literally the same first and last name. Not many times does that happen. Um, but anyways, so I have you guys uh in a list here from here. So Jack. And then Richard, Michael. So this is how I'm doing this list of you guys. It's in the order of 
you know, that you're, you're on here. So I'm going to start off with this, and I'm going to random you guys. And then I'm going to start off with the team's alphabetical. And then I'm going to random that. So this is how I determine your random team. It's both your, your name and the team is going to be random, if that makes sense. Uh, one second. What did you say? Oh, yeah, fun fact. I'll show you guys. For those that didn't know, this is my group. This trading card restock, information, Walmart, Target, Barnes, etc. This is my group. I made it. I made this back in last summer. So this is 100% my group. If you aren't part of it, join it. Uh, it's just a group to share information. I actually posted it in it uh, yesterday. Let's see if we can see my post. Just a group I made to help you get some cards retail or make it easier to find some cards. Uh, yesterday I was back home in Green Bay, so I posted Green Bay. They stocked and I got some mosaic, so yeah. Um, but yeah, that's my group. <laughs> Anyways, fun fact, if you're in it, small world, right? 25,000 people are in it, so could be a big chance. Uh, what first and last of this kid? Here, I'll show you. I'll, I'll, I'll look him up. I'll look him up. I'll look him up for you. It, it's, it's fun. It's funny. That guy. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, this is him. Columbus High School. Jack Fritz. He doesn't have the third, though, like you. So, But it's the same name. Same exact name. All right, so anyways, here we go. I will do your names. I have to look at this to see your comments. I thought you said you had the same. Yeah, he did. He does Jack Fritz. That's your name, right? Jack Fritz, F R I T Z. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the only. I'm the only person I know with my name, so it's it's sort of cool to be the only person, but at the same time, not many. I've never heard of another Jack Fritz in my life. All right, so I'm gonna roll the dice here. I'm gonna roll the dice. Uh, we got six plus three, so nine. So I'm going to randomize your name nine times. Here's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Last time, nine. Nine times. So I'll put plug in. I'm going to delete this, actually, and I'm going to change it. So Chris, you're up top. Now, now I'm going to do, all right, so we got that taken care of. Now I'm going to do the teams. And we're going to roll the dice again. Two dice. Five. I do five or higher. Many breakers do five or higher. Some do seven, but I do five. That's pretty jumbled enough. So... We'll randomize the list five times. One, two, three, four, five. Five times. So, here are the new team names, or not new team names, but here are the Assign teams that you got, or the random teams. Wow. Couldn't think there for a second. Here's the random teams that you have. All right, so Chris, I'll plug your name right next to the names, actually. Chris, you got the Reds. Brian, you got Arizona. Joe, you got Oakland and Boston. Jack, you got Houston. Michael, you got Chicago Cubs. 
Texas is going to Jason. Ron, you're getting my Milwaukee Brewers. Richard, you got the Indians. Have they changed their name yet? I don't think they have. Mets going to Brian. Richard, you got the Twins. Michael, you got Detroit. Mike, you have Miami. Jack, you have the Nationals. And Richard, you have Colorado. All right, so these are your randoms. Just so you know, this is how I did it. These are your randoms. All right, let's see what you had to say. That's awesome, my mind. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know, it's pretty crazy. It's pretty crazy. Literally, I've never met another Fritz in my life. But same first and last name. Here in Wisconsin, where I'm teaching, there's another one of you. There's another one of you. Pretty crazy. He's going to play uh, college basketball. I forget where at. I think. I think uh, Carol, Carol is a. Uh, it's a Wisconsin, like a smaller Wisconsin college. All right. Anyways, um, here we go. I will start off with a break. I just spent eighty, literally eighty dollars on supplies yesterday, so I got these fancy dancy rookie card top loaders here. Um, just got a bunch of sleeves. So, anyways, um, I like this also because I could I could sort of control the price profit that I'm making, which for this break is not much to be honest. Um, after eBay fees. And most of you guys actually took spots off eBay, which I do a deal off eBay um, because I don't have to deal with the fees. And plus everything gets sent to my taxes, um, so I don't have to worry about that. So that's why I do is deals off eBay. Um, so anyways, uh, yeah, I, I like it because I could sort of control the price. And if I don't make money on breaks, so for an example, this break... Let's see, 40, I played 40 plus tax, 22, 22, 22, 22, 22, 88 plus 50. So like 50 plus so 90 plus 88. Is that right? So like about 160, 170 dollars worth of stuff. Um, and then I set the price to where I'm not losing money. So if, for an example, if this was a picker team, a lot of baseball breaks don't actually sell for a lot, which blows my mind. So if I were to make less than 170, 180 on a picker team where you bid up your team, um, I have in my description that I will cancel it. I've only had to do it twice with football. It was like $300 worth of product. I only would have made 150, made 150, no profit. I would have lost 150 basically is what I'm saying. And that's not even including shipping or supplies. So, you know, I just spent 80 bucks on supplies, um, card supplies. I also spent money on my ink, my printer, <laughs> and um, uh, what else? The bubble mailers. So I spent another good 100 bucks on bubble mailers at a time. So I spent a lot of money on supplies. Oh, yeah, team bags. I got, got some team bags. I spent a lot of time also. So if I don't make profit at least if i don't break even then i will cancel the break so i like this because you get to choose one of your teams and um it's pretty cheap and for a fraction of what it actually cost me <clears throat> so you're paying even on ebay you're paying 20 bucks shipping's always that cost five bucks i don't control that but um, but yeah, you're you're paying twenty bucks as opposed to for one of your teams that you want plus a random, so ten bucks a team, and that's a fraction of what it's actually cost in the store. 
So that's a pretty good, nice deal. I love doing breaks. I love doing breaks, but I like I like this setup because it's beneficial for you and me. Empty box. And as I sort of mentioned before, many of you know, because most of you have braked with me before, if that's the correct word, or maybe it's broke, broke with me before. Um, I'm from Green Bay, so personally, all I care about is Packer cards. And um, actually, I'm going to cut all the tops of these. This is the only product I'm cutting the tops off of because I've had a lot of issues with with uh, these packs. But anyways, um, what, what I also, I say it in my football breaks and most of my other breaks because it's quite interesting, but what I'm saving up for, um, I mean, any money that I make, though, it, it goes back to buying supplies, buying products for the breaks for you guys because I always like to do breaks. Um, but if there's really any true profit I'm making, it go, it's going to pay for my season tickets. So I'm now a Packer season ticket holder at 23 years old, which is insanely young. So I have my own Packer season tickets. And um, Jason, thank you. But no, I'm kidding. Yeah, it is falling apart. But I do have my own Packer season tickets. If you don't know anything about them, the waiting list for those tickets are over 100 years long. Um, I'm about 30,000 on the list, so I wouldn't get them until if I actually waited. I wouldn't have gotten them until I'm I'm about 60 or 70. But my grandpa got them about four years ago, and he knows how bad I love my Packers. So he transferred them into my name. <coughs> <coughs> and what I will say is it's not cheap. So that's what I'm saving up for. Any true profit that is made. So anyways, here we go with the break. Um, I'll let you guys know, just so you know, the uh, how I do my piles. The far right pile, these are all going to get shipped base. So these won't get anything. Besides, they will be in a, a team bag. Um, the middle pile is going to be a sleep pile. And the left pile is going to be top load pile. If you by chance see me throw something in the wrong pile that you want sleeved or top loaded, let me know. Um, I do mention it in all my breaks. I'm not the biggest into baseball. I do watch baseball. I'm actually a PE teacher. Um, that's what I was saying before to Jack is one of my students. Has the same name as him. I'm a, I'm a gym teacher, PE teacher, so I do watch baseball. I teach it. Um, but it's my least favorite sport, so... I don't keep track with all the guys, um, and I don't watch it as much as I do football. Just, you know, being raised in Green Bay, I love football. So um, if I do put something in the wrong pile that you want sleeved or top loaded, just let me know. All right? But for the most part, I have a pretty good understanding. Uh, Charlie Blackman, all rookies will get sleeved. Or I think I think so. Da yeah. Daniel uh, Cabrera. Eloy Jimenez. Jimenez? I don't know. That's another thing. I'm going to mispronounce a lot of these names. Many of you know that, that it broke with me before with baseball. And Christian Pesh, Pesce. I'm going to mispronounce a lot of these names. All right. But all rookies and I believe all parallels will get sleeved. Jacob deGrom. Jake Eater. Uh... G. Mitchell and Geraldo per Perdomo. Yeah, just be just be patient with me. Garrett Mitchell. Um, I'm going to mispronounce a lot of these names. Christian Yelich, I will not mispronounce Christian's name. Was that two? Did I grab two? Jake Eater, I don't know if... Uh, I don't think I grabbed two. I, th I thought it looked like I did when I set it down. Christopher Morrill, Matthew Allen, and Trevor Story. Shane Bieber, Ezekiel Duran, Max Scherzer, 
and Raphael Devers. All rookie parallels will get um, top loaded, by the way. Javier Baez, Dylan Dingler, Ding, Dingler, yeah. Edbert Perez and Anthony Rizzo. All of these Chicago cards will be are great for starting fires, you know, as I say. Mike Trout, Gilberto Jimenez, Jared Schuster, and Freddie Freeman. I do not look like looking over at my comments and seeing that team is falling apart. I do not like that that's still up there, so I'm not I'm gonna pin it. It is they are. They are. They really are. Chris Sale. I think it's Sale. I used to say Sale. I don't know. I like to mispronounce things on purpose too. Carmen mm, I don't know how to say that. Casey Mize and Jordan Alvarez. Alex Kirloff, Asa Lacey, Fernando Tatis Jr., this is numbered 192 out of 199, and Jarrett Cole. I know Fernando is one of the big names in the MLB. Too bad this isn't a rookie, but still, numbered to 199. It's a pretty high number, but... I don't know. I, I personally don't know the, what that would be valued at, but that's got to be a decent hit, I would think. Especially for this stuff. This stuff is not that great. I unfortunately, when I saw this in the store the first time, um, <clears throat> it was my first time ever seeing this. But I did a lot of, I did a ton of chrome breaks. <laughs> hey, well, I, I got something cool t to tell you about your dolphins. Um, but I, I did a ton of chrome breaks, a ton of, uh, you know, the good stuff, Bowman, chrome. So I saw Bowman platinum, and I was like, well, Bowman is good, right? Platinum seems pretty elite, if you ask me, or if you ask any average Joe. I don't know. Platinum seems... Like the top tier stuff. Well, I did a break with it. Should have done more research on that, but <laughs> did a break with it. And I opened it up and I was like, oh yeah, I can see why this isn't that sought out. But it was it's still fun to uh rip. I mean anything is fun to rip. And I've I've done pretty decent with them. I've gotten some autos. I'll take more tatas. <laughs> uh, Jared Kel Kelenic, JT Ginn, Joy Vato. This is numbered Voto. I don't know how to say that. 138 out of 299. And Garrett Cole. Uh, but what else can I tell you? Who, who said, Jason, you said... Um, you're a Dolphins fan. You now have Alec Ingold, which is honestly <clears throat> one of the only, if not the only, good fullback, if not good fullback in general, but especially good fullback in football in the league right now. Um, the cool thing about him, he was on the Raiders. He came from UW-Madison. The cool thing about him is I played against him. I went to high school. Uh, he's from Green Bay, so. William Contreras, Cade Cavalli, Seth Johnson, and Trevor Story. So, yeah, um, I'll also go through this pile, this base pile, if I, if I miss anything. I'll obviously sleeve or top load it, but, um, but yeah. Uh, Alec Ingold, if you heard of him, I played against him. Bobby Delbeck, Cole Wilcox. Uh, Jay Rodriguez and Geraldo Perdomo. 
Julio Rodriguez. Mm -mm. Nolan Arenado, Clayton Beater, Matt Chapman, and Rafael Devers. I will say, though, um, big Waddle fan, love Wit too. Oh, yeah, Waddle, he's, he's good. He's good. We'll see if Tua could turn it around. Uh, Justin Verlander, Jordan Westberg, Ismail Mena, and Anthony Rizzo. Um, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, uh, I don't know if anyone here was in this. Who's in this break was in the one. I think it was the first time I did this half random half pick your team break, but I did a. I opened up one of these Bowman Chrome Mega Boxes, and it had an out of twenty five. I forget who the biggest name Yankees is. Yeah, I bought a waddle. Oh yeah. Oh, did Jason, you bought a waddle off Jack? Is that it? Or did he buy it off me? I don't remember selling a waddle. Sam Huff, Isaiah Green, Nassim Nunez, and Freddie Freeman. Yeah, I <laughs> I took uh, second to last place in fantasy football last year because I drafted Tua and I drafted uh, Justin Fields. Oh, you bought one off me? You're going to have to look at our messages. I don't remember that. Juan Soto, George Kirby, Tyler Stephenson, and Jordan Alvarez. Oh. Oh, okay. You bought it off me or did I... Open it for you. Kohi, uh, I don't know how to say his name. Kohi area something. <laughs> Tyler Callahan, Kyle Lewis, and Christian Pesci. Pesci. I don't know how to say that, but I like saying Pesci because my college roommate, his last name was the same P A C H E L. So it's the same, just had an L at the end. And we called him. Facial, just to be funny. All right, two more of these Bowman Platinum. I could do this very. I could do this very fast, but um, I don't. I don't want to. I don't like to speed rip unless I've got a lot of stuff. Like with football, I've done um, an entire. An entire uh, box of Donruss packs. And if you know anything about those packs, those packs are ginormous. So I just skip to the hits with those. I speed. And sometimes I'll speed rip if it's taking a while, but this isn't a big break at all. It is. It's decently sized, actually. It doesn't seem that big, but it's, it's not bad. It's got two, three, four, five, six blasters and a mega. But mostly I know the Mega Box is what you all want anyways. But I like to uh, I like to take my time, let you see your cards, because I have one of Pasha. Pacha? Pacha? Oh it's Pacha like that. Uh but I actually I got <laughs> I've gotten some complaints from people in my break set. I take too long or I go too fast. So I try to find a decent speed. Francisco Lindor. I haven't gotten any complaints recently, but I just find it funny that, you know, some some people, they complain what they complain about. It's like, i personally never seen a break that's gone, um, oh, Posha. Posha. Okay, like that. Nick Madden, Jazz Chilsholm, and Ha Seon Kim. Um, I personally never seen a break that has gone less than like half an hour, and that's what he was complaining about. He was actually he was actually not watching the break live. Like some of you might not be watching this live. Those that have breaks with me before, you know, you could skip my intro. I do an intro um, with all my breaks, so I talk about myself, say the rules of the break. Oh yeah, I didn't even say the rules of the break. 
I don't really think that there's men, any rules of this break because there's no college cards. But I say the rules of the break. I show the teams, and I started. I literally started the break. So I had the break set up at like seven or five. I forget. And I did the break like I started it twenty minutes early, because sometimes I'll do that so that it shows up on your timelines. Um, but yeah, he just went off on me because he's like, "Why did I have to listen to you talking for twenty minutes before you started?" And I was like, "Well, you know, fun fact: I, when I was live, I started twenty minutes before, so that is why." Uh, Cody Pellinger, Alexander Vargas, JT Ginn, and Eloy Menez. I'm actually going to put this in one of these new rookie card top loaders that I have. I'm going to switch it out. Why do I have these if I'm not going to use them, right? Um, but yeah, my point is this. The point about that story was I sometimes just find it a little funny what people will complain about sometimes. Like, I don't know if he was having a rough day or what, but I try to I try to always have an open mind and be nice. And I was I was I was nice about it. I just told him, yeah, I I did I started it fifteen minutes early, so um Jose Altuve, Maximo Acosta, Freddie Freeman this one is numbered 108 out of 299, and Max Scherzer. So it seems like basically every blaster I've opened with this, and I've opened a lot, probably like 40, comes with a numbered card. Never seen, no, I think, yeah. It looked different for some reason. <clears throat> but I, I I've received some funny feedback, too. Uh, Spencer Howard, Kyle Harrison, Max Meyer, and Whit Merrifield. Like, I have a feedback. I don't know if anyone looks at that, but it's your content. <laughs> I know, I know. Thank you. I appreciate that. I have a feedback on my eBay that says um, I'm, I'm great at my breaks because I <laughs> just said, you just said I don't know much about baseball. And he left me a neutral feedback. And I was thinking about contacting eBay to remove it because they remove stuff like that. Like, if it's really, like, I've, like, that, that's just stupid. But um, that was his feedback was I, I'm great at breaks, but just don't know much about fe uh, so or not softball, uh, baseball. Wow, I could not talk. I don't know much about baseball, so I just left it because I think it's pretty funny. Joey Bart, Spencer Torkelson, Cade Cavalli. And Sixo Sanchez. Does this have a... No. I think all these cards so far are looking pretty decent. No, I'm not, I don't, I don't want to take forever. <laughs> Thanks, Jack. I don't want to take forever, but... <laughs> it's just... I've got a lot of funny funny uh, feedback and stories. Clark Schmidt, Eric Rivera, Sixo Sanchez, and Vladimir Guerrero Jr., like, I don't think many people realize this. I don't know what other breakers do. I mean, I, the person that I used to break with um, would talk a lot during his breaks too and do his own thing, but we all do our own thing, and that's what that's something that I like. It's not everyone's the same. Uh, Clayton Kershaw, Matthew Allen, Jay Walker, and Joy Vato. Jordan Walker. But I don't think many people realize this, but I'm I'm an actual person. I'm a I'm a PE teacher, you know. I I have a life just like you. So sometimes, you know, I might if I if I have something if I had something if I I've also had breaks where I've scheduled it at five, and I might have done it a day early because I got notified I had something last minute. I had something to do the next day. Then I might have done it early. Max Kepler, Jared Schuster. Mookie Betts, and Andres Gimenez. But yeah, I think most people are understanding about that, and I, I've never had a complaint about that, and it, do, it doesn't happen often. But sometimes if I do have a break, schedule for a day, I might do it a little earlier or a little later. I'll do it definitely within, within a day, no later than a day, because I like to do them fast but um i also give you guys a whole 
day to pay, uh, which was, which is um, not how this break went because you guys paid as you took your spots or when it filled. But if you are breaking with me and you do a random team, then you know I let you, I let you guys uh, have up to 24 hours about to pay, give you guys a day to pay. I used to do it the same day. I used to have my breaks end at like noon and I would break at 5 or even break at 7. But I had so many people not pay. So many, like... I'd have at least three people each break not pay by the time I broke. And I was like, what the... In the, in the description, it literally says... When I'm going to go live. Walker Bueller, James Beard, Alec Bohm, Rookie Parallel, and Six, Sixto Sanchez. Love to see these Rookie Parallels. I don't care what product it is. Rookie Parallels are my favorites. Too bad that's not a number card. He's right. <laughs> Jared Kalanick, Drew Romo, Marco Luciano, and Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Yeah, I... <laughs> when he's... Okay, I've had... I was I was just shocked when you when you said that you you didn't want them anymore because I was I literally have had that happen for the past three times with this half pick your team half random break is people took spots off eBay and then I had to relist it on eBay and it takes another like it it could take up to a whole week to fill two spots it'll fill it'll fill but it sometimes takes up to a whole week and I was like man I just want to rip this today or tomorrow <laughs> William Contreras. Emerson Hancock, uh, Isaiah Green, and Ha Seung Kim. But if you do, if you do pick spots um, like this, I will. I mean, you could take the spots, and I'll I'll let you know when it fills. You don't have to pay right away. I'll let you know when it fills. But um, Matt Chapman, Patrick Bailey, Col uh, Z Zach Fien, and Joy Votto. Zach Fien, what? Oh, it's numbered. I was like, why does this look? Uh, 136 out of 250. Is he a rookie? I, didn't, I never really understood with these cards if they're rookies or not. Mm -mm. Hey, yeah, it's, it's all good, Jack. I, d I don't know. Are you, are you into football or are you into baseball or what? Are you into all sports cards? For me myself, I'm only into football, and I'm, and I know you, the last time you broke with me is football. Kyle Lewis, Ethan Hearn, Jordan Westberg, and Andreas Gimenez. Oh, he is a rookie. Okay, I'll put that. In. Well, no, I'll just leave that in that one. Joy Gallo, Tommy Henry, uh, M. Luciano, and Whit Merrifield. See, I always figured that these were rookies because they look I mean, they look younger than I do. But it doesn't say it anywhere on the card. And I don't think I've seen them in any other product. Although I, I do remember seeing Zach Veen. So that's why I thought he, he was a rookie. But it, I don't think it says rookie in anything. Bobby Delbeck, Robert Hassel, Nate Pearson, Bus, Buster Bosey. Only packs left. Last pack. Come on, let's get an auto. I've only I've opened up like forty of these, and I think I've only got like three of those. Nolan Arnado, J T. Ginn, Josh Donaldson, and Bryce Harper. All right. Well, Jason Odom. I'm not a baseball fan either. You're not. Were you? Did you just get? Spots to support me? Because if that's the case, jeez. Or do you just like doing breaks? Because I, I don't know. The, the way that I see it is, especially baseball. 
especially baseball. Um, it is the best value for your breaks by far. Love Bobby Ritz. 2018. Yeah, I have to look him up. I don't have to look him up right now. I've never heard of Bobby Witt. I'm young though, so I haven't heard of a lot of people. Unless Bobby is also young. Oh, he, is, he does look young. Alright, never mind. He is young. I think it's pretty crazy, though, with how big the MLB is. A lot of people, they're like, oh, yeah, I, I know I know someone who's in the MLB or, like, in the minors. I don't, I, I don't think I know anyone personally who's in the MLB or who has made it that far. Oh, number one prospect. I, I, I Googled him. I think it said he's from 2019, right? But, yeah, I don't know anyone who has ever been in the MLB, but I know people, I only know people in the NFL or that I have ties to, you know. Uh, Mike Moustakis. Oh, wasn't he a brewer? Shane uh, Shane Bieber. Clayton Kershaw. And Devin Williams. This is going to my uh, brewers. And I'll get saved. Did I say 2019? Oh, yeah, he is. It says he was in 2019. But he probably moving up. That's another thing that I don't... That's so confusing about baseball with me is just how many players there are. And, you know, they they're, they could be in, in the minors for a long time before they get moved up. And then when they get moved up, then everyone's like, whoa, he's so good. <laughs> Uh, Can Brian Hayes, Nelson Cruz, Isaac uh, Paredes, I don't know how to say it, and Chris Davis. But um, I don't know. It's it's not like that's that's not really how it goes with football though, where you get drafted and then you're on the practice squad for some years and then they move you up. You know, it's. Not the same with football. So. Oh. Although sometimes that does happen, like undrafted guys or like, you know, yeah, undrafted guys. I think Devontae Adams was undrafted. Undrafted players sometimes just are amazing, but typically it doesn't happen like that where they, they get sent to the minors and then they have to work their way up. Uh, Debbie Garcia. Did I say that right? Jose Altuve, uh, Kenta Meda, I don't know if I said that right, and Tyler Stephenson, awesome, rookie parallel. Is this numbered? No. Looks very cool, though. You will hear of him. I do, I will say this. I will say this. Say whatever you want, but... A few things about, uh, like, the feedback of me not knowing baseball. Um, I've done a lot of breaks I've in ripping ships. Many of you know what that is. Of people who have no clue about football, but I do ripping ships sometimes with them, and they just are clueless when it comes to football. They're like, is that good or not? And you have to sort of help them out. Um, so it, it happens. Also, I've opened a lot of Pokemon, and I know nothing about Pokemon. Well, now I know a little bit about Pokemon, not much. But um, uh, I do have, I do play MLB The Show quite a bit. Kesson Hira, uh, Max Scherzer, did I say that right? Dane Dunning, and David Dahl. So I do play MLB The Show. I do. I like that game. I have it on my Xbox. Uh, Lucas Giolito. Kyle Lewis. 
Anderson Tejada, Tejada, and Jacob DeGrom. Also, another thing I will say, speaking of that, sort of speaking of that, is I did just get the Oculus Quest. Um, I won that in a res. And I didn't think anything of it at first of VR, but I will tell you this, it is amazing. Spencer Howard, that's a parallel, so I'm going to top on that. Brandon Crawford, this is another parallel. Jazz, Chris Holm, and Cody Bellinger. Wow, I'm going to top on all those. That first one didn't look like didn't look like a parallel, but it uh he's got some red lettering there, so we'll throw him in the in the top load. This one is a silver, so Miami. Whoever's got Miami. I think Miami was a random team. Was it? Miami Mike. Mike has Miami. It was a random team. So you got this sweet silver rookie parallel. Come on now. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to remember the the Yankees, the big the big name Yankees player, but. Uh, yeah, I thought it was crazy. The first break I ever did of this half random half picker team got an out of twenty five card of of him out of this uh, mega box. I didn't even realize that at first. I had to look it up, and someone had to tell me because they put the number they put the number in a very weird spot that I didn't look. Cal Tucker, it was like orange too. It was weird. Uh, M Lourdes Guerrero, Matt Olson, and Joy Bart. Joy Bart. All right, one more pack of this first blaster. Then we got uh, one more blaster to go. We should do a football, baseball break like this, like a mix, like throw some baseball in here. Thanks, Dad, for liking. Like, throw some baseball cards in here, you're saying? Or do, like, do, like, a football break like this. Because the thing, the thing that I like about this is that, well, I mean, it's, oh, this is a silver. Yeah, I'll sleep him. For baseball cards like this, there's not really a team that sells for more than other teams, but... If I did something like this with football, obviously everyone would get, you know, Jacksonville, Chicago, New England. Uh, Pete Alonzo, Lewin Diaz, Stefan Strasburg, there we go, and Sean Murphy. Like random team is football. Oh, like a full random football break? I've tried that. I have a full random basketball breakup. But that's not getting anywhere. I've got no spots taken on that. I have tried a random football break, though. It never filled. But I could always try it again. I've got a bunch of mosaic now. 218. This is the last ever... Pops Chrome blaster I have for now. I mean, I don't know if I'll get any more, but probably, probably not actually. I think they're done making this stuff. Now it's all in next year. Oh, like random team is football? Like where you pick, so you pick, well, there is 32 NFL teams, or 30 MLB teams. So if you're saying, like, pick an MLB team and then you get a random football team, that'd be interesting, but I'd have to somehow do something with the extra team, or two teams. Dalton Versho, maybe someone just gets two extra teams. Uh, Andrew something, this looks 
this looks like a hit, so I'm gonna say that for last, actually. That looks like a pink, bubbly hit. Probably numbered. Jake Cronenworth. Christian, what do you say? Pasha. Starling Marty, Marty, and Kyle Lewis. I don't know if that's going to be a hit or not, but I think it is. If I recall right. Uh, or, hey, Alfaro. Shirton Apostle. Kevin Newman, a silver. And Iandro Kirk. This is a rookie. So he's getting the top load. Rookie parallels get the get the top load. Maybe I could do something like that and then Well, I don't know. It'll be pretty pricey, I think, actually. I don't know. Maybe it wouldn't. Dallas Kukul, Ryan Yarbro, Yabro, Lourdes Guerrero Jr., and Tim Anderson. Four packs left. Nick Madrigal, Hyun Jin Ru, I don't know if it's Ryu. Luis Castillo and Aaron Judge. I will have these all out, by the way, uh, before I start up my football break, just so you know. So I'll have these all out within a few hours. Lance McCullers Jr. I don't know if I said that right. Uh, Tariq Skubal. Juan Soto and Fernando Tatis Jr. There you go. There's a Fernando Tatis Jr. And it's a silver out top of him. Two more packs left. And then I will reveal that hit thing. I don't know what it is. Uh, Trevor Story. Yadir Molina, Brandon Lowe, and Clark Schmidt. I'm getting burned. What teams do you have? Hey, one card is all it takes. One card is all it takes. I'll, I'll say that right now. What teams do you have again? Luis uh, R.A.'s. I don't know if I said that right. Mark Clevinger, Max Kepler, and Stefan. Something. The pinks are nice. Yes. I, I, okay, actually, this stuff, I like the, um, the photo variants. I, I forget what they're called. Like this. I like what I'm holding in my hand. I like these. The ones that are going to the right. All these ones. The pinks. You're saying I should top load these pinks that, that aren't rookies? Is that what you're saying? I should top load these pinks that aren't rookies? I'll do that. All right, Andrew something. Oh. The teams to the right. Oh, like these these teams. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> uh, Nick Madrigal. I'll top of this right away, and then I will show, reveal this. I might have to get a different top loader for that, that card because I think it's a thick card. So uh, after I open it, I will... Get a yeah, I see, I see. He's saying his card. 
Josh Hader. Wow. He actually, fun fact, he is my favorite brewer. Uh, 229 out of 350. He is my favorite brewer. <laughs> All right, I'm going to be back in a second. I'm going to go get a thick top loader for that. A thicker top loader. Already just got some of these super thick top loaders yesterday, so perfect time to use one, right? Look at that, fits perfect. There you go. Milwaukee. Got a numbered card. All right. This is the last one of these. Hopefully we get some good stuff. I will say this right now, knock on wood. Knocked on wood for you. Um, every one that I've opened of these, almost every one besides like two, and I've opened up about 30, have been good. They've been good. I don't know how else to say it. They've been good. Most of them have been very good. I don't want to make any promises, but the ones, at least the ones I got at, I got them all at the same store. For some reason, they all have been pretty good. I don't know if they all are good, or most of them are good, but from what I have been told. Alright, I will do these packs first, then I'll do the special ones. Xander Bogertz, Akil Badu, Yerman Mercedes, Jose Garcia, and Garrett Crotchet. Alec Baum, Nolan Arenado, Josh Donaldson, JT Realmuto, and Francisco Lindor. Uh, Ian Anderson, Brady Singer, Eugenio Suarez, and Whit Merrifield, and Luis Arias. Wow. Tongue tied. <laughs> Tongue tied. <right? laughs> uh, Gerardo Perdomo, Javier Baez, Juan Soto, Brian Reynolds, and Vladimir Guerrero Jr. All right, last pack before I reveal this, these uh, mega box, these exclusive packs. Freddie Freeman, Miguel Cabrera, Kirby Ruiz, Luis Patino, and Spencer Howard. All right, here we go. The two special packs. Let's see if we get anything good. Hopefully we do. Ooh, what is this? What is that? Is that like a, a redemption thing? That might be like a redemption thing. I don't think I've ever seen that. I've never opened up a box like a box with a redemption thing like that. All right, we'll reveal that one last one. Alec Thomas, Luis Matina. Yeah, all these, I will say this, all these have been just insane with brewers. Um... Uh, Ed Howard, Tyler Soderstorm, and just, yep, like uh, like what I said, basically all these that I've opened um, have been filled with brewers. I, I mean, I I don't know if they sent all the good brewer ones to Wisconsin or what, but. I think that this is going to be an auto, though, so. 
this could whatever this card is it could make or break your day jack all that complaining to get a one of one see i'm joking about it now but watch it be a one of one i don't know i don't know if you could get one of one out of here i never opened up one of these so i'm gonna have to make sure that i don't reveal anything my gable I've never even really seen one. All right, cool. We'll go with this. Drew Waters in the back. Matt Manning. And redemption card. Congratulations. You'll receive a mega box chrome autograph of Ismail Mena going to Chicago Cubs. Can I reveal anything? Is it on the back? Oh, it is on the back. All right. So, Ismail Mena. Is he good? Is he good? How, how, how big of a hit is this? Someone let me know. How big of a hit is this? That's going to Chicago, so I'm going to look him up. Ismail Mena. Is he good? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't know how much that is worth. I'm seeing like 30 bucks for other products, but I've not seen that product. So I don't know how good that is. It hits a special. It hits a hit. It's, yeah, a hit is a hit, especially auto. Did you get that? No, Michael. Michael got that. Michael got that. Dang it. I mean, a hit is a hit, especially in auto, yes. But I was, I was just... Wondering if it's like if he was a rookie or something. But anyways, uh that is the break. I will have these all out. Um if I don't have your address, please send it to me in a message so I could have these shipped to you. Alright. So I'm way to the <laughs> I'm way to the right, yes. Check, I your your stack will be about this big. This big. If you never break with me again, I totally understand. <laughs> Your pal is mine. Wait, what? <laughs> Your pal is mine. I don't know what that meant, Jason. But, um, anyways, if I don't have your address, I'm going to PM you for your address, and then I'll have these all out to you within a few hours, all right? Jack, I hope so. I probably will not, I mean, hopefully you'll be back with football. Unless you like baseball. All right? But anyways, I will uh, go live again in a few hours. So have a good Friday.